Hello and welcome to our channel. It's the Rise of the Goddess 717 and I am here today to do our second channel daily message. Yay, I'm happy to be back. We got two today. We are back on track. Thank you guys so much for being here. Happy 11-11 portal. And there's a new moon coming in in Scorpio, okay? So I want to make sure I got these out to you guys because I have to take off tomorrow, okay? Um, and Monday because I have to balance my energy. I'm a Scorpio and this is my moon coming in, so I got to make sure I'm balanced. Um, make sure you guys drink plenty of water. Um, keep your vibrations high. Uh, let go of anything that does not serve you. Release trust surrender okay lord god has you covered um so you guys can receive what's coming in okay the new beginnings okay any karmic cycles that you've been holding on to release them it's okay because what you when you hold on to things god can't bless you with what you he has for you you're blocking the door let it open release so you can get what you deserve okay that's for someone um i will go over everything at the end I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for being here. If you're new, welcome, welcome, welcome. Oldie but goodies, love you guys so much. Thank you for being here. All of your love and loyalty. Thank you for all the birthday wishes you guys are still giving. Thank you so much. Thank you for the happy anniversaries. Thank you so much. And um, if you guys have not subscribed to both channels, make sure you please do. Because we, I don't want you to miss anything, okay? I know I got a lot of karmics watching me too, but I'm happy they're watching as well because it's a blessing, okay? I'm, I'm in my purpose, so I'm not bothering anybody. Um, they're welcome as well. I hope they get some healing while they're here. Um, if you guys have any other questions for me, uh, just wait to the end, okay? Let's dig on into this message and see what we got for our message for today for you guys, alright? We're gonna start with a shuffle. Alright. We got Taurus. Some type of phone calls are coming in. It's gonna change every, anything. A phone call coming in, okay, from a Taurus, okay? It has to do with a Taurus or it's from a Taurus. Was a phone call coming in to you, okay? And let's see what we got going on here. Capricorn, somebody's in devil energy. Some type of toxic energy here. We got to do with Capricorn. Karma. Yep, this is dead. So, the devil is needing to be dropped. So, if somebody's been, like, like I said, if somebody's been holding on to uh, karmic connections, anything karmic in your life, is you're going to get karma for it. If you don't release it. That's why I said what I said in the beginning. Lord God never has me say anything as a high priestess for nothing. A high priestess sits quiet with a bubble on her head. So when I say something, it's meant for someone. Um, the, car, the, the Capricorn um, is the devil. And you're needing to release it in reverse. And regardless if you want to release it or not, it's going to be released. Okay? So karma is going to either get karma for it or you can release the karma so that you can transform and gain what God has for you. Okay? Phone call that's going to change everything is coming in, okay? Children are a factor in reverse. Some type of karma coming in when it comes to children. Mm -hmm. If you guys have been hurt because of a child or ch because your babies were mistreated, prayers have been answered. That's coming in for you guys. It's justice for babies is coming in, okay? So that's for somebody that's blessed. That's a blessing for someone, okay? When it comes to children. Congratulations. What else we got going on here? Ooh, fall, the nothing card. We ain't seen this card in a long time. The nothing card. Yeah. Somebody says balance. So somebody was holding on to something, and the phone card changed everything to center energy. So they've been holding on to, the, to, to a karmic debt, and they've been told to release it. They're getting karma for it. The phone card's going to change everything because somebody was holding on to nothing. Libra, some balance coming through. We got Sagittarius too, okay? So Sag and Libra as well. The Taurus, yep, a Taurus coming in. So you got you guys got Taurus on with a fight here. So if you guys have a Taurus that was coming to somebody, a Taurus that you were dealing with, or one that you were with before, or some involving a Taurus, or a Taurus is coming back to you, this person is about to fight for you, okay? They flipped out together. Taurus, fight. All right. We're gonna take. A, we're gonna get a clear message. What else we got here for our shuffle? Yep, emotional outburst. 
Somebody's about to have some type of outburst here. Yep, but we got Gemini. So we had a lot of signs today, y'all. Yep. A message is coming in you don't want to hear. Somebody really miss you. We got cancer here, too. Uh, somebody got played here. They missed the opportunity, being a player. It was a lesson for somebody to learn. Rejection was God protection in the situation with somebody getting karma for playing a lot. Yeah. Yeah, that's what we got here. Give me one bottom energy. You guys got new love coming in. Yep, because somebody else don't want to take responsibility. So somebody else been playing for too long, and now you guys got new love coming in. You about to get a new boo. Uh, eh, eh. <laughs> yep. One more clear energy, Lord God. got Scorpio. <laughs> There's about to be a, this the death card. As well as if you're a Scorpio, I'm a Scorpio. I'm a Scorpio Capricorn as well. But, um, um, that's about to be some type of ending. Somebody's uh, karma may be for a pen to pass away because they've been doing spell work too. Yep. Some type of drama queen. Okay. It got to do with a drama queen. <sighs> Lord, have mercy. Wow. That's crazy. Drama queen over our energy. That's what we're going to use here. Let's get on in this message, y'all. Ciao. What's going on here? The Capricorn in reverse. These cards are flying. Yep, something that's not going to heal. There's no hope in the situation. Somebody's been holding on to the devil, and there's no hope in it. They were holding on to it for absolutely nothing. They didn't get something out of something. They refused to let it go. Yep, it was not wish fulfillment. There was no growth here. There was no hope here. Something to shut down. There's also somebody could be sick as well, too. And they're not, whatever they sick from, they're not going to heal. What is the karma here? The death. What did I say? Somebody's karma, they're about to pass away. The death card. That's also ending in the rebirth here. So, like I said in the beginning, karma. Okay? Karma's coming through so that something can end. To have a new beginning. Yep, there, there was some type of um, bread karma situation and balanced connection. But that's definitely somebody here that's something that got something that's not gonna heal. Yeah. What's the phone call that's uh, gonna change everything? The emperor. Mm-hmm. An emperor in reverse is calling. Somebody didn't re somebody didn't transform. Yeah, an emperor that's in reverse. This person is refusing to be upright. This is why new love coming in. Because somebody else is has been holding on to karma. Somebody has been refusing to transform. Somebody has delayed their transformation, and this person was supposed to align with you. Mm hmm. That's why the, the other person's coming out. Somebody could come in like a raging bull and, and come towards you. Somebody that's ready. But this emperor in reverse, this person's coming in. It's going to be a phone call that changes everything. It's going to cause some type of shift. Yeah, this person could always solve the drama queen. It could also be a child that wasn't this person's. Or somebody who you have kids with that did not take care of their kids properly. They abandoned you guys. They're getting some kind of karma here when it comes to that as well. Yep, the emperor in reverse. Some type of tyranny controlling energy. What is nothing? Yep, a burden. Somebody, what did I say? Somebody went towards something here. They're getting karma. This person set themselves up for, for a whole line of bull. Yeah, they did. Somebody was very much stubborn, a tyrant, wanted to, to prove some serious point here. But karma's bringing it to a rest. God has given somebody a chance to transform and do what they need to do. This person stayed in a connection or a situation that was not wish fulfillment. The devil was holding on. They were holding on to a karmic connection, karmic things, energies, whatever it is. There's something here that will not heal, something that was not happiness or wish fulfillment. There's some type of ending coming here or somebody could be passing away and it could be their karma. But this emperor was very much controlling. This person has something to prove, okay? There's a fall card that's coming in from this person or about this person that's going to change everything. They've been holding on to something here. The Ten of Wands, they've been carrying a burden for nothing. Why is it a nothing card in so long? They've been carrying a burden for nothing. Holding on to all of this situation here, this person was stubborn. This person has something to prove. And they've been doing it for nothing. This person, I know they feel like a real serious fool. 
yeah, this person feel like a major fool. I mean, if they, if they, if they're not sh saying it, they, they, they feeling it. Cause this person here is a bit foolish. Yep. What's well, emotional outburst? Yep. The world. Cause this person, they've been refu been refusing to end a cycle. Yep. So they've been suppressing. Somebody, something's been, somebody's been suppressing something here. They've been repeating the cycle over and over and over again. And they're, they're, the, the cycle, the karma's coming down where God is imploding everything, everything's coming out. So whatever they were holding on to is um, blowing up. Yep. This person going to, they, they've been suppressing and whatever they've been holding on to suppressing is going to, they're going to have an explosion of a outburst. Mm-hmm. Yep. They've been dealing with some type of drama queen. That's the overall energy here. A queen of swords, a bitch. Yep, this person was a knight of wands. This drama queen was a whore. Yeah. And that person, this person attacked them. Yep, worked against them. This person could have worked against you. That's what's causing them to have karma. The ships are coming in with being a karma for choosing the wrong lover. This is karma, judgment in reverse. Karma, 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 karma. That's all we got on this board. Yes, that's karma three times. The situation was never love. Somebody poured your cup out for somebody that was not even worth it. For nothing. Nope. And the, the Wheel of Fortune is coming around. The Wheel of Fortune is turning. Yep. It was, it was, uh, it was all a dream. Yep. The Knight of Swords in reverse. The Page of Cups. It was an illusion. It wasn't even real. Mm mm. What they were holding on to, it wasn't. Somebody straight played themselves here. And the Drama Queen. It's coming down. Whatever it is, it's coming down. It's karma. Yes, yeah, karma keep coming out. It's a lot of heavy karma coming in here. Yep, drama queen and Taurus fighting. Yep, yep. So the the, the this person wanted to hold on. Somebody wanted to hold on to a drama queen. So you guys are about to get somebody with Taurus in their chart that's coming towards you. That's want to fight for you. Yep. Cause somebody else been holding back with the Leo. Somebody playing themselves. They played themselves for for a Jezebel. Yep. What else we got here? What else we got here? Give me some more. Yep, an unofficial person. Unofficial. And somebody was looking for sudden wealth and it was nothing there. Yep. Somebody played themselves for an unofficial connection, unofficial person. Somebody was looking for something that was never going to happen in the situation here. Overall energy is the death card. Yep, we got imprisonment as well. Somebody could be um, going to jail for um, unaliving somebody here. Yep. Wow. It's not going. It's not going to turn in their favor. The community turned against them too. It's not going to turn in their favor here. Whatever this is, it's not going to turn out in their favor. Yeah, the community, somebody turned from the community turned against this person here. The courthouse is not going to turn out in their favor. Somebody going to jail here. Yes, it's a shift. It's a crazy shift change here. Yeah, it is. Unwealthy man, this person. So what it looked like to me, somebody went towards something that they thought was um, a jackpot. They thought it was going to take them to a certain level in their life, okay? Somebody knew that they just, they just knew that they chose right or went down the wrong, the right path. But what they went down, what they did, how they did things, um, they were, they had many callings to change the situation too. Yep, false persons, overall energy. I felt that card too. Wow. Man, female. A karmic. Mm-hmm. This Jezebel all over this reader. You have somebody in despair about this person, too. Mm-hmm. Wow. Somebody went, went for broke. Yep. They were played. They had a mask on, and they were parading in a community with a mask on. This person was hiding behind something, wanted to um, prove something with some type of image here. They portrayed something that wasn't what it was. An unofficial person, though, sudden wealth, they went towards somebody they thought they can get rich with by any means necessary. Yeah. Somebody thought they had something here that wasn't here. Yep. We ain't seen this car in a while. We got jackass in the building. Mm-hmm. 
Yeah, this person was crazy to say goodbye to you. It looked like somebody went, they went the wrong direction. They kept shows wrong. Yep, they were a jackass to say goodbye to you. Because it was all it was all spell work. Yep. And true colors are coming out here in this in this community. Yeah, true colors are being exposed because it's, it's ending in betrayal, some type of backstab here. Hoochie. Straight up betrayal. Yeah, it is. It's a serious betrayal. The spell work keep coming out. Oh yeah. Somebody see there that this there's a lot of um a, a lot of this stuff is clearing. Yeah, it is. A lot of this is clearing. Legal matters. Somebody going to jail. Mm-hmm. And somebody true colors. A divorce property. They, they were dealing with a criminal. This person was not who they thought they were. Paternity fraud. Yes. Child support fraud. Property fraud. Divorce, criminal activity. This person was doing a lot. Yeah, they were dealing with a, ma a major criminal. They got themselves tied to some type of toxic karmic community. Yeah, divine masculine. That's who it is. Yep, that's who it is. What else is going on here? Tied up as a legal matter. Somebody in trouble. Acting fake busy with you. This person, this person was, this person that acted like they didn't have time for you. They, they, they were messing with no strings attached connections. Yep. That's a clear energy, Father. What else do you have for this reading here? Give me another energy. Yep, karmic ties. This person was holding on to nothing. This person here was has something to prove. And it did not work out in their favor. And no matter how much this person tried to... Um, Prove something. It just was not going to happen. They were living in some type of um, fairy tale illusion. It wasn't real, and they were trying to show 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 you up. Yeah, by saying goodbye. I like this karmic tie better. I like that card better. Okay, we got um, Lord have mercy, Jesus. Yep, evidence. This person is caught up. Somebody going to jail. Yeah. Somebody going to jail here, and they were caught up in some type of situation here. Yeah. They were hiding something, too, because of childhood wounding. Release, moving on, letting go. And whatever it was, this person, they, they stayed um, stuck in the situation here. I like that, that evidence card better. They stay in the situation here. There's a lot of gossip going on around the situation with this person. They were two-faced and their mask is coming off. Yeah, two-faced. This person's mask is coming off. Yep, it has and this false person. Both of them were false people. Yeah. The person that they chose over you and this person were both false people. And it's been it's been exposed in in a, in a community here. Somebody was just stay straight went towards something that was foolishness. This person's being betrayed. We got the police. They've been crossed. Give me a bottom energy. Their wishes were not granted in this situation. What this person was looking for did not happen. Nope. It surely did it. What they were hoping for did not come through. What they, Whatever they crossed you for, it wasn't worth it. Nope, they're not happy. This person's miserable. Oh, child. Let me get, um, sit with my iced coffee before we get started up in this, honey. Wow. Wow. Mm. We got imprisonment and death. We got courthouse in reverse and we have community in reverse this people been this person's been shown from a community or both of these people mm -hmm. or they're shown because of the false person that they were that they entangled themselves with whatever this is this is a karmic tie a karmic debt from a past life this person was tied to some evidence 
this has been saying it for a while. I've been on this platform three years now, and I've been telling you guys for about two years about some a maskless checking their finances and checking their credit scores and checking their deeds and anything they had their, their name signed to. I told them to make sure that they check their email addresses to make sure there's nothing linked to it. Because whoever they were dealing with in a relationship, they gave this person control of their finances. If they thought this person was the empress. Yep. So the, 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 you were taking care of the bills. You would have been taking care of the bills if you was divine feminine. You would have been taking care of your parts. Your person was going to work and doing whatever they did to take care of this person by any means necessary. And this person was backstabbing them every day. Yep, jackass. This person was a jackass for leaving you out in the cold saying goodbye to you. That's what they messed up at. Wow. Spell work. Somebody sees the true color. Somebody knows that they were played. Yep, this is coming to the surface. All this, the spell work and the spiritual warfare is coming. It has to clear. We got legal matters and the divine masculine. A lot of them are facing legal matters that keep coming out. Yep, and, and uh, uh, going to jail and stuff keep coming out. Karmic ties and evidence. This person, this was a karmic debt. Yep, this is a karmic debt. Two faced and false person. Yep, this is this, this the problem here. You saw that? Go dark. That's the problem here. Two-faced false person. This person was jealous of the of your part of the divine masculine. This person was a hater. They were fake. They were gossiping. They were lying. The whole entire time. Yep, unofficial person. And this person had nothing to offer. This person didn't have shit to offer. This is a, I mean, a major bomb, y'all. This person had nothing to produce. Nothing was going to ever come through in this situation here. Nothing. Let's move this over so we can show. I had a Lord on here where he can be seen. Yeah, we do. Okay. All right, let's get started here. Wow. Mm. There's a tower coming down. It's going gonna, it's gonna to drop hard. Whatever this tower is, it's going to drop hard here. Yep, it's coming in reverse. What is the courthouse here? Somebody going to jail. It's going to shock the hell out of everybody. Uh-huh. Blindfold coming off. What did I say? Somebody uh, was played here. So if there was spell work being done, th there was court case magic being done in the past, too, in this situation here. This is um, not going to work anymore. It's in reverse. It's time to pay, pay this debt off. Lord God is allowing... This, t this debt to be cleared in the way of a tower in reverse because somebody has been delaying Lord God's divine timing. So the blindfold is coming off when it comes to the courthouse. There is no more spells that are going to work when it comes to manipulation of the court system. So this situation is not going to work out in somebody's favor as their karma for them playing with divine timing. What is good about here? Mm, 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 mm. Yep. Defeated. This person, somebody tried to defeat you and deplete you. This person could have depleted you. They could have used you. A lot of slander with the mouth. A lot of lies and deception with the mouth here. But that's the swords. That's talk. Somebody was two-faced towards you. And they were a jackass to leave you out in the cold and say goodbye. What's true colors? What's true colors? Yep, the emperor. What did I say? Somebody wanted to be you. They chose the empress in reverse over the true empress. It was spell work. We got a wanna be in the house. And this person, they're being they're being shown in the community as a lying ass criminal. A wannabe. A doppelganger. Yeah, this person's been exposed. They used a lot of spell work to get what they wanted and to set this whole scheme up here to set this person up. This person wanted to, they, this person came off like they were gonna take care of everything at home. Like I said in the beginning, this divine masculine was played. This person was being set up right in front up under their nose. If you guys warned your person about anything like uh, putting cameras in the house or recording or anything uh, uh, when it comes to this person here, they regret it now. Because this person was setting them up the whole time. This person was being very deceptive for this person to take this fall here. Yes. What's divine masculine? What's <laughs> divine feminine? What's divine masculine? 
justice. Yep, this person's going to this person's going to jail. This is karma. This is the justice system. This person's going to jail. Yep, that they God God gave. That's what, that's why we saw divine feminine when I shuffled. It popped up halfway popped out because you were sent in to help this person to not go down this road. This person kept trying to make this stuff work here. They were determined to make this situation work. To prove this point here. By any means necessary. And the evidence that, that, that they have, the evidence that Lord God is allowing to fall here is heavy. This person will tie themselves to karma. Yeah. What's the evidence? What did I say? This person got tied to this. What did I say? With her witch. Mm-hmm. All the secrets is coming out. All the evidence has been exposed. This person set them completely up. This whole connection was for them to destroy this person and have them wrapped and bound in karmic debt and ties. And whatever, and whatever was being done here, this false person was living this life. This person was being a criminal, but they were tying your person to the tying this divine master to the debt here. Yes, so this person was breaking the law. A lot of, of, of course, some of them knew. What was going on? But they didn't know. The, they didn't know the full extent to how much that they were being deceived in this connection here, and they were being set up to take the fall. A lot of you guys warned this person. You warned them about the situation here. You were brought here to stop this from happening. Justice is coming in the situation when it comes to divine masculine. Coffin. Yep. It's, it's, it's an end to a coven. Into a third party situation. It's ending here. The tower's falling in reverse. And it's also a coven of people here. There's going to be some um, issues when it comes to uh, imprisonment. More than one person could be going to jail. There could be a community of people. What's the community here? Yep. What did I say? Reckless. Reckless energy here. Yep. It was a lot of people that were tied together through uh, sexual energy as well here. Yep. Some people could have been sleeping with um, judges and sleeping with uh, lawyers, officers to set the situation up. Somebody was very scandalous. Oh, yeah. Jackass. What's jackass? Yep. This person. They killed in the beginning. When they walked away from you, they screwed themselves. Yep, this person here, they, they were defeated too as far as some of them with their sexual energy here too. There's not going to be a new beginning here. This person was depleted in the situation. They, they, they defeated you and they ended up being de de depleted in the situation they went towards. Instability. What did I say? This person was a false twin. They wanted to be you. Yes, they did. Four of Wands in reverse, it was a faulty foundation. Lord God is letting it fall with the tower in reverse. This whole situation is falling down. This person had nothing to offer. It was not a real foundation. That's also false mortgages. That was mortgage fraud. When it comes to homes, uh, finances, LLCs, think this, it was all fraudulent. That's the reason why they got the, uh, the S-Corps. Yeah. If you, guys are, if you guys are business owners, you got to be s -corp by the beginning of the, of the year. I don't know what deadline they, they haven't gave us a deadline yet, but just get that done. Yeah, because there's been a lot of fraudulent companies that people have been making up. That's why we have to be S Corp. Yes, we do. To make us a, a broad business. Yeah. To make you legit. Make sure you're legit and on paper and know that, know that your business is actually up and running and functional and not fraudulent. Because of this type of stuff here, it's been a lot of fraudulent companies that were made up. Yeah, and this this situation here, the government is shutting down on it. Oh yes, and this person here, these people are involved with this, and it's falling. It's not working anymore. Everything that was done, God is bringing justice into the situation here. Yep, so it's a lot of it's more than one person going to jail here. Yep, a lot of people stressing out about it as well here. Yep, the divine masculine stressed the hell out because they made they kept making the wrong decision and they kept on trying to prove a point and they see now that they were a fool. Yeah, this person sees that they were jackass here. What's karmic ties? Yep, what did I say? They were betrayed by karmic ties. But they, the, the masculine kept allowing these knives to go in their back. But they, they were refusing to change and move. This, part, this, this masculine here had something to prove. 
This person here would be what's being manipulated. The cycle's ending with the world. It's ending with a tower in reverse. The blindfolds are coming off here. This person was a jackass. They, they were defeated by a burden. This karma was nothing but a freaking burden. This communi karma community that they were involved in was nothing but a freaking burden. The Ace of Pentacles in reverse. The Empress in reverse. The person had nothing to offer. Absolutely nothing. Everything was stolen. This is a fraudulent person here. Yes. Eight of Pentacles is something financial they're going to jail for. The situation here is falling apart. There's nothing that's going to work out in here. The situation here, anything that was stolen from you or caused any, any financial ruin in your life is all coming back towards you. The cycle of, of, of um, hell is over. The cycle of betrayal is ending. Instability is ending. Financial loss is ending. As long as you continue to walk your path in a line. Everything's going to open back up for you. Okay? So please do that. The devil here. What did I say? The devil dropping them on their head. It was a karmic connection. This was heavy spell work here. We got the high priestess in reverse. And we got covens, practitioners, and the devil. Yep. Betrayal. The situation is being released. Whatever was stolen is coming out. It's coming back to sender. It's, it's being returned to sender. The cycle of stealing and theft is lost. It's, it's over. Uh-huh. Wow. Mm, 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 mm. Yep, the two of cups. This person, they carry the birth person for like a jackass for um, not having a beginning with you, not giving you an opportunity to, to be with them, not choosing you. This person chose the wrong situation. They chose they chose a burden over a two of cups. They chose stress and, and uh, mayhem over happiness. Uh-huh. This person feel like a jackass. Yeah. Third party. They chose a third party. They chose a third party over their actual twin and released their twin flame connection or divine partnership. Yes, for an Ace of Pentacles in reverse for something that was not going to grow. For a loss here. This person had nothing to offer for a criminal lifestyle. This is a fraudulent criminal that they tied themselves to. This person got their name all screwed up in all types of ways. There's all time this mortgage fraud, there's all types of mess going on here. This situation was nothing but an illusion. Their whole life, life was a lie. The money that they thought was there was never gonna was never gonna happen here. Will of fortune. The will has turned in your favor. What did I say? Everything is coming back towards you. Any work that was done on you guys is in reverse. The key is to do your healing work and to keep walking your path. This is how the stuff keeps re revolving. And your justice is coming in for the devil. Yep. What did I say here? This person was betrayed. The judge. This person going to jail. They were set up by a karma connection. The way this connection is about to end, your person, this divine masculine, or, the, or them in the whole coven, are going to jail. Mm-hmm. The judge is going to uh, rule. The raw truth is coming out. And the judge is going to rule. This person is going to find out that they were truly betrayed. They're going to hear your name in their in they head. Because you guys, a lot of you guys to, try to warn this person about a lot of things when it came to this connection here. Who? The emperor in reverse came right back out. Just like in the, re the beginning of the shuffle. <sighs> Divine masculine. That refused to transform. This person was a tyrant. They were very much greedy. They were selfish. They did not care. They wanted things to go their way. They were willing to do whatever. And they fell for this bull crap of a connection that they went towards. Trying to make, and they tried to make it work over and over and over again. They were an unofficial person and they were dealing with a false people and false person. Their wishes were not granted in the situation here. It was a very shady connection here. It was nothing but shade going on in this situation. Wow. Give me some more. What else? What else? At the bottom of the deck, legal issues. Somebody going to jail. Mm-hmm. And this part is they empty. There ain't no money here. No money here. Yep. So whatever they was living before they didn't have, when I say money, it did not manifest. Yep. Windfall, receive money, owe money in reverse. This person owes a lot of money to a lot of people. Yep. You ain't, you ain't, shh, for dropping a twin flame. Yep. This person... 
they 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 feel like a true jackass for dropping you and this is this is justice for you the will has turned in your favor for you guys being mistreated yeah what did i say the truth is coming out but this person so this was all this person was manipulated by spell work every all this was done by spell work this whole situation was a lie somebody has been living a full-blown lie hate hates on your power Magic shine. This person wanted to outshine you. This masculine wanted to one up you for whatever reason. They wanted to show you something. They wanted to uh, make you make you uh, be jealous of them. Show you that they can be with the person that they're with and live you guys' life and live happily ever after. But it was a criminal life. It was not real. No. Tries to block your blessings. And now their blessings are being blocked because the will has turned in your favor. Mm -hmm. What did I say? The truth was coming out here. It was nothing but a, a third party, unlearned lessons, and a toxic karmic connection. That's all it was. Yep, the situation was very karmic. This is what they left you for. Magic potion spells. And karmic third parties. Yep, and somebody riding dirty. Okay, somebody got something. Drip STD burn diagnosis chlamydia. Somebody got something, and somebody talking about it. Somebody stirring the pot about that too. They running their mouth in in the hood, telling somebody business here. Oh yeah, somebody could be going to jail because of that too. Mm-hmm. Spotlight clarity. It's all coming out. Ooh, child. Somebody got themselves caught up in some mess here, hunty. Yes, somebody riding dirty. Mm-hmm. What else is going on here? Somebody's obsessed, too. They have been talking about you. Somebody's talking about you and obsessed with you. Talking about you every day. Mm-hmm. But they, they're the one who ended the cycle with you. You guys are in a new, in a new beginning already. Yep, this stuff, this stuff is behind you. Somebody refused to walk their path. Mm-hmm. They thought they were being smart. We got LB, L, LGBTQ um, came out of bisexuality, supportive, supportive of rights for all, conflicted about judgment. This person, some type of legal, the, the truth coming out about that too. Somebody was hiding their sexuality is coming out. Mm-hmm. They've been lying. Pathological liar. Low self-esteem. Living a double life. Lies about even the smallest things. Lying boosts their ego. Somebody been living, living a lie here. And it's coming out with the tower in reverse. I mean, that means that that's going to be public humiliation. Somebody going to be exposed about their sexuality that they've been hiding. And it's going to blow up. It's blowing. It's coming out. And they can have legal issues tied to it, too, where it exposes them. Yep, binge eating. Somebody eat, overeating, too, right now, too. Binging on junk food, extreme food guilt. Somebody could be, um, they carrying this burden, which made them eat more. Yep, toxic karmic love. This person, they treat you like you wasn't shit for a toxic karmic love. Uh, refusing to lose, to see see how, I'm sorry. Refusing to see how destructive the, the connections is. They refuse to see it. Staying regardless of red flags, convenience, marriage, codependence. This person staying in this connection regardless. Ace of Pentacles in reverse. There was nothing here. Absolutely nothing here. The kids were not theirs. If they married them, it was a false connection. You're the empress. And they, they, they left you in reverse. Mm -hmm. This person was self-absorbed. They are worried about themselves. Obsessed in the gym, all about them, their looks, narcissistic traits. This person cared about themselves and they care about you. Dark intentions. What did I say? And they they walked they, this toxic love had nothing but dark intentions for their life. Warning to control you, manipulate manipulating yourself, worth, self esteem, mind games to keep you hooked, using you for their gain. This person, they they got played by this person here, but it's because this person had dark intentions towards you, so it backfired. Mm-hmm. They set themselves up. When they released you, they mistreated their twin and their divine partner. Yep, they were secretly jealous of you. Yep, envious of your success, tries to dim your light, plant seeds of doubt. And this karmic was very much negative 
Like this person feel like they weren't worthy of anything. Yep. Evaluation. Getting drug tested. Mental health evaluation. Raising concerns. This person going. They going. Um, when they go to court, they're gonna have to take some evaluation too, and mental evaluation as well. Yeah, boiling point. I'm about to blow up here. Reaching insanity. A fight is brewing. Everything is coming to the surface. That's what's going on here. Mm. Let's get a couple before we get up out of here. Poo child. Mm. Yep, a scribe. Alternate facts of plagiarizing. This, this person wanted to be you guys. Alternate facts of plagiarizing others. Plagiarizing others' work. Yep, this karmic really wanted to be you guys. Yep, you guys were the true mystic. And they came off as the mystic in reverse delusional report with the divine. You guys have intimate union with Lord God. You're connected to Lord God. And this karmic tried to come off like they were you. And your person believed it. Yeah, this masculine messed up real bad. Saboteur. Induces self-destruction behavior or the desire to undermine others. This person... That they were they tried to sabotage you and they ended up treating you like crap for a karmic connection and this karmic sabotaged them because you guys were you were the visionary you were a blessing for this person capacity to envision what is not yet conceivable to others you said it everything that's on this board you warned this person about you may have not have known who it was what was going on but you warned them god gave you an epiphany and he you warned this person willingness to proclaim a vision without regard for personal gain you try to help this person you were a divine partner if you did a twin flame you saw straight through it wow amazing god hmm. give me one more yep a guy they rejected you they rejected their blessing you you were here to stop this from ever happening to this person Mm -hmm. you, you were a visionary you saw it before it happened you were also a mystic you're very gifted they rejected their guide places financial gain and control over imparting spiritual insight they were focused on financial gain and what they can get from somewhere else you represent the nature of divine and life and in yourself you guys walk the light you were a guide for this person but this person went towards a karmic dead mm -hmm. yep I'm on going on you guys live in a um a lot of you guys are celibate. Give me one clear energy. What did I say? This person thought. Whoever this karmic was, this person thought that they were God. Or your person could have had a God, a God complex too. Uh-huh. Despotism and cruelty using power to control or to control people. These people were very crooked. And they're getting, getting caught up for it too. Lord God is coming in. And he's spanking butts. What did I say? A femme fatale is what they chose over you. Inappropriate use of sexuality, attachment to money and power. They thought that they was going, if I rule the world, that's what they thought. Mm-hmm. That's what I just heard. Wow. It was not real. Somebody got played here. They set themselves up for a serious situation, and this person came in to destroy them and slay this person. And that's what they allowed to happen. And this person's about to get in trouble for it. And the phone call coming in is going to change everything. It's coming to you. There's some serious karma here. <clears throat> and come back to this. This person left you for nothing. Phone call that changes everything. Emotional outbursts. God is making this person drop the devil. Mm hmm With karma. But they refuse to let it go. They're getting karma because of it. That's what we got here. We're going to take this over to our second premiere, which is um, on the home channel platform. I am um, thankful to have you guys. If you guys uh, would like to join us, uh, the, link to, the link it says first channel and second. First channel and new channel in the description box. Make sure you guys click the link, subscribe to both channels, and click the notification bell for both, okay? Um, I have two questions for $15. If you guys um, would like to um, have an ASAP, I have 48 to 72 hour delivery for $10 more for the two questions for $15, okay? Um, if you guys, we got two, two um, videos on sale, okay? I'm going to get to the, the people that um, I'm going to choose, okay, as well. So I'll be putting that up soon um, for my four people. But we got two... Um, Readings on sale this month. You got Spiritual Warfare, regular price $77.77. And it's on sale this month for $65. Then we got the Past Life, Life Purpose Reading, which is a major one. 
Um, it's very heavy. We go into your past life. Lord God takes me back into your past life to show me how to help you correct your karmic debts. This is a karmic debt. Somebody was refusing to heal. Yeah. You were sent in as a visionary and a guide to help this person by God. Visionary guide by God. To help them to clear this karma. To stop themselves from going through this. God wanted to give this person justice and they went towards karma. That's why I say you never know who God sent in to help you. That's why you can't mistreat nobody. Amen. Um, you never know who God has for you. Thank you, Jesus. Um, and it may not come looking like what you want to look like. That's why you can't mistreat it because you don't know. Message for somebody. I felt that in my soul. Um, yeah, so the past life reading is going to take me to past life to show me how to help you correct your karmic debts. That's on sale, regular price, $80. We're doing it for 65 bucks this month, okay? Um, you guys, uh, if you have any questions for me, all the readings are, all the options of readings are, is in the roster below in the description box. Uh, if you guys have a question about a reading that you don't see, just let me know, okay? I have a few others that are not on the list, but just inquire about them if you want to know. Um, we have PayPal, Cash App, and Venmo. All that's in the description box as well. And if you have any questions about booking, please email me, okay? Um, we have a payment plan for every reading on the platform except for the emergency readings. So if you need that, let me know, okay? Thank you guys so much for all your love, your tokens, your gifts, your all the love that you give me, I'm grateful for, okay? I thank you in advance for any blessings that you give to the channel. PayPal, Cash App, if you choose to send a, a love token, um, just let me know it's a gift, okay? And then we got... Um, Gifts, my okay. If you want to send me a gift, PO box is below. Okay, I love you guys so so much. I thank you. If you need me for anything at all, email me. All right, I love you, and I'll talk to you soon. Let's get to the next video. Namaste.